Hello, I'm going to show you how to do a bleach photo effect on your photo. So for this photo, I'm going to use a photo that I shot recently, not that long ago, at an air show. Let me just move this over here like this. And so when I shot this photo, at an air show recently, I set the camera for flat. And when you see this photo, you can tell that the photo is kind of a low contrast photo. And the reason why I did that, well, normally if you see a shoot a photo normally, like the way that the camera default uh, setting is, uh, the whites right here would be very white and possibly almost blown out. And then anything like on these jets would be, you would see shadows would be a lot blacker. And so when you, when a photo is very low contrast or flat, uh, you're not going to see a lot of uh, bright areas and you're not going to see very dark areas, which makes it easier to work with in Photoshop or whatever, uh, you know, software that you use even on your phone uh, it makes it easier to control and adjust things so uh, right here these f18s they're the blue angels um, we're going to actually make these uh we're going to give a bleached photo effect which almost looks kind of bleached a little bit right now but let's just first uh the first thing that you're going to do for this effect is you're going to add an adjustment layer and right here you're going to look for black and white so you're going to add a black and white adjustment layer so i'm going to do that and when you do that instantly you'll see it goes black and white so depending on your photo depending on how much contrast you have you're going to adjust some things so right here we're going to adjust the blending layer so it should be set to normal now, remember, whatever you do in Photoshop, Photoshop has a tendency to save it. So, you know, just double check this next time when you add something that it went back to normal. So I'm going to come down to overlay. Now, when I put overlay, you can see the effect is very pronounced. Okay, let me just move this right there. You can see the effect is very pronounced. Now, we don't want it that much although i think it actually did a pretty good job it's a little bit contrasty so what i'm going to do is i'm going to change the opacity i'm going to change it down just bring it down a little bit and then you know so i'm going to maybe bring it to like 70 or something like that now i can change it more but i think that does a pretty good job so for you when you're adding it you probably want to adjust the over the uh, opacity somewhat, depending on what your photo needs, you might have to bring that down even more. So if I bring it down all the way, that's what it looks like without having anything on it. And then as I increase it, you can see it changing more and changing it more. So I think like right around for this photo 70 is good. And you know, experiment, there's also different layers you can experiment to besides overlay. But that's how you can get a photo to have a bleached photo effect. Hopefully you get something good out of that.